Welcome back, everyone. Let's talk some softball this morning on Conklin and Company. And you're saying, well, uh, why? We don't ever talk softball on this program, but we're going to today. And for very good reason, we'll welcome in uh, special guests, Vicki and Jay Schramm, retired Toledo police officers uh, and, and now uh, members of the Sylvania Senior Softball Association, correct? That's correct. And uh, organizing something really special coming up in just a couple of weeks. And, and Jay, I'll let you start. Okay, you're the president of the, of the organization. What's happening over at the Ned Skelton Stadium? On well, this May 31st, 31st mm -hmm. we're going to host the Wounded Warrior Amputee Softball Team to our area. That's the first time we've ever had them into this area. And we got the idea from an ex-player who moved to Tennessee. He played against the Wounded Warriors in a charity event and called me and said, you got to check these out. They're very, very inspiring, very motivated, very talented mm -hmm. ex-veterans, and they play with prosthetics. And that was kind of amazing to me. And I more I got into the research and through Google and YouTube, I found out a lot more about them, and it really inspired me. In fact, uh, we come from a... Uh, kind of a veteran-oriented family and so forth. And um, I, I started seeing that they also do with, work with uh, kids through their day camp. And so we got the idea, I ran it through some of my fellow ball players out in Sylvania, and we started w working on this program since 2011. It's mm. really grown. Wow. And uh, it's off to the races. Hopefully uh, we got a lot of sponsors, a lot of people that have really come forward and helped us out here. Uh, mm -hmm. And we're looking forward to a good turnout. We've yeah. got a lot of neat events that's going to happen that day. Yeah. And Vicki, you said that, well, there's a direct, uh, Jay mentioned the correlation with the, the military, but there's a direct correlation in your family. Tell us about it. Correct. Our son, um, Matt, went to, was in the Army, mm -hmm. and he was sent to Iraq, and he was in the very first wave of bombings that they did in Baghdad. Mm. And uh, he was in the army and and fought for our freedom and he was of course near and dear to our heart and uh, mm. so he was not injured thank god mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. uh, i'm also a, a veteran i was in the air force for five years and uh, jay's father was a colonel he okay. retired from the service and his sister was in the service. Yeah, the roots run and deep so here. And so it sure. runs deep. Yeah, no, no question about that. Yes. And I imagine everybody in the family, uh, baseball, softball fans too. Huh? Yes. Yeah. We uh, all are. Yeah. Yeah, I can see that. We've all played. Yeah, I mean, I played. It, it, clearly. He's playing. We ran that website of the amputee, the uh, the team, the Wounded Warriors team, and if we run that once again, you can tell these guys are incredible athletes. They are. They very, are. <laughs> I mean, very really, good. really good players. <laughs> Uh, and, and it's interesting, reading their bios, their interests, every single one, they're baseball players. Sure. They're baseball first, then softball, and now this is a, kind of a labor of love for them, isn't it? They travel all over the country, Jay. Yeah, well, matter of fact, it's been since 2012 when I actually began communicating with their coach, Dave Van Sleet, and it wasn't until this year when I was able to get the date to have them here, um, which is like I say, May 31st, mm -hmm. we wanted to, I picked that date, I wanted to get it before the kids got out of school, mm. before they run on vacations yeah. and so forth. And, and so it did work out. I was fortunate to get Ned Skeldon Stadium because one of our Sylvania ball players, Al Seeger, uh, has connections with the Rec Center and mm -hmm. Line Drive Sports that operates that right. in the Mambo Corporation. So we were very lucky in that respect. And uh, some of our ball players have gone out there and done some light maintenance work at the Rec Center. We spruced it up. It's, it's, it's a great place to play. Nice. It's you very bet. nice. Roy Hobbs League out there too. They, they still play there. Yeah, it's some a high very school Very nostalgic games. place. Got a yeah. lot of history there. So you found a great place to play. Mm -hmm. Try. It costs some money to bring this group in. Correct. Correct. Vicky? It it does. Twenty thousand dollars. Correct. We have to pay their lodging. We have to pay their airfare we have to pay for everything for them while they're here and so we have to raise raise that money mm -hmm. for them and uh, we have to pay that and then so how the, are you doing on that um we're getting there okay but uh we need all the help we can mm -hmm. get well hence is the show conklin and company sometimes we uh you know we promote uh, what we think are really really worthy causes so uh just to, in order to help contribute uh to be part of it uh, contact what Sylvania Senior Softball Association? Well, we have a link to our Sylvania Senior Softball website, 
And if you look at the uh, SylvaniaSeniorSoftball.com, there's is. a link which says, yeah, WoundedWarriors.html. Mm -hmm. You hit on that link and every inf all bits of information that you would need are there. We have a post office box set up where folks and can make a, uh, a payment to through the mail or drop something off at Fifth Third Field or just co basically come out that day, whatever you can give is, is you know, we're not, we're not out to, to uh, it's we not want a money grab. It's not folks. a money grab here. No, no, no we're out no. to accommodate the folks and see some of the old tigers and. Yeah, so let's talk about the game specifically. Okay. We're going to run out of time. I don't want. You're going to have. You've got uh, secured some former tiger greats to come down. Uh, Jay, who are they? We've got Denny McLean, Tom Magic, Stanley Clark, Mickey Stanley, John Warden, possibly mm. John Hiller, wow. and there's a few more. But I'm not going to mention because they're not committed. Yeah, a lot yet. of guys from the '68 Tigers, though. Yeah, huh? they yeah. see they played there a lot back in the young their younger days, so it's kind of a nostalgic. Uh, they played at Skeldon. Sure, yeah, coming sure. out through the sure. ranks. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Back then, the old Tigers and the Mud Hens would play each other once a year. Yeah, those were the days. Yeah. So those were those were great. Oh, yeah. days. Well, it happened a couple of years ago at Fifth Third Field, but uh, it, yeah. Tom Matchick. Toledoan, yeah. right? Yes, he is. Yeah. And Stanley Clark, I believe. Yeah, he's a it. Toledoan. He yeah. didn't play for the Tigers. I believe he played for Toronto and yeah. a few other teams. But he's going to play also. Awesome. And we've got some other celebrities, local celebrities. Yeah, some celebrities are going to yeah, play too. We're going to bring them out and some radio disc jockeys and some people that have done good things in the community. We've got a couple ex-veterans in our league that won the Purple Heart. We're going to place them on the celeb team. and. Plus, we're bringing a lot of vets. We're getting the word out. If there's a vet out there that wants to come and be honored, we're going to do our best to, to get them out on the field and, and introduce their name and have them tip their cap to the crowd. So Sounds like an incredible day. It really we hope it, it so. should be. We should, it we should think be. So. We're, it we're is tired. May 31st. We had three dates up there, but May 31st yeah, is the, the big day, right? Correctly, yes. Uh, you have three games that day. Yes, sir. Uh, the Tiger game, is the is that the first game or the second game? No. Third game. Yeah. Okay. Well, it, it's going on all day, yes. right? Yes. Go by Ned Skelton Stadium. Here's the day. Contact Jay Schram or Vicki Schram and go to that website or that phone number and you can be part of what should be really an incredible day. We hope so. At Ned Skelton Stadium. Count thanks, guys. It. Thank you Thank very you, much. Jay Schram, Vicki Schram, thanks very much. Thank the Wounded Warriors you. amputee softball extravaganza coming up. Have a great Sunday. We'll see you in two weeks, preempted next week.